What if I told you the SR-71 Blackbird, the fastest jet ever built, has a successor that's not only faster, but can fly so high and fast, it might as well be a ghost? Meet the SR-72, the hypersonic drone that's set to revolutionize aerial reconnaissance. When the legendary SR-71 Blackbird retired, many believed aerial reconnaissance had reached its pinnacle. But what if its successor, the SR-72, is poised to take this legacy even further? Lockheed Martin's Skunk Works division has developed this hypersonic marvel to embody the most daring technological breakthroughs of the past few decades. In today's video, we'll uncover how this revolutionary drone is shaping the future of aviation and defense. Can the SR-72 surpass the iconic Blackbird in speed, stealth, and innovation? Let's dive in to find out. The story of the SR-72 begins with the retirement of the SR-71 Blackbird in the late 1980s. Known for its Mach 3.3 cruising speed, unmatched altitude, and record-breaking reconnaissance missions, the SR-71 was untouchable, dodging over 4,000 missiles during its service. Yet despite its awe-inspiring feats, the high operational costs led to its early retirement, leaving a void in U.S. aerial reconnaissance. Enter the SR-72, or the Son of Blackbird. First unveiled in 2013 by Lockheed Martin, this next-generation hypersonic platform was designed to fly at Mach 6, twice the speed of its predecessor. Unlike the SR-71, the SR-72 is not just a jet. It's an autonomous UAV, unmanned aerial vehicle, that combines stealth, speed, and cutting-edge ISR, intelligence, surveillance, reconnaissance, capabilities. The engineers at Skunk Works face monumental challenges in designing this hypersonic drone. At such extreme speeds, conventional engines wouldn't cut it. The solution? A dual-mode scramjet engine developed in collaboration with Aerojet Rocketdyne. This engine combines a standard turbine for takeoff and subsonic flight with a ramjet system for hypersonic speeds, enabling the SR-72 to seamlessly transition through multiple flight regimes. But speed isn't the only game changer. The SR-72 also requires materials that can withstand temperatures exceeding 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit, far beyond what traditional steel or aluminum can endure. To tackle this, engineers are using advanced composites and high-performance carbon ceramic alloys to keep the drone intact under extreme conditions. While the SR-72 has mostly remained in the shadows, glimpses of its development occasionally surface. In 2017, Lockheed Martin announced that hypersonic propulsion testing had been successfully completed. In 2021, a teaser video showed a single-engine prototype resembling earlier SR-72 renderings. And in 2022, the hypersonic aircraft even made a cameo in the blockbuster movie Top Gun, Maverick, sparking public curiosity all over again. Beyond reconnaissance, the SR-72's potential as a hypersonic missile platform could redefine aerial warfare. Launching missiles at such high speeds poses challenges, but Lockheed Martin's successful experiments with prototypes like the YF-12 Interceptor suggest that the dream is within reach. The SR-72 prototype is anticipated to soar into the skies for its inaugural flight by 2025, with full operational deployment projected as early as 2030. This ambitious timeline has stirred excitement in the aerospace and defense communities, as the SR-72 promises to revolutionize aerial reconnaissance and hypersonic flight technology. Often referred to as the Son of Blackbird, this hypersonic unmanned aircraft aims to achieve speeds of Mach 6 a staggering milestone that would make it twice as fast as its legendary predecessor, the SR-71 Blackbird. Yet as bold as this vision is, the road to achieving it is laden with challenges that extend beyond the technical realm and delve into financial and logistical considerations. One of the key challenges is the immense engineering complexity involved in developing a vehicle capable of sustained hypersonic flight. Hypersonic speeds generate extreme heat due to air friction, with temperatures soaring beyond 3,000 degrees Fahrenheit. This requires cutting-edge materials, such as carbon composites and advanced ceramics, that can withstand such conditions while maintaining structural integrity. Moreover, integrating a dual-mode propulsion system, one that transitions seamlessly from a traditional turbine engine to a scramjet capable of handling supersonic airflow, 
adds another layer of difficulty. Lockheed Martin's Skunk Works division, known for its engineering ingenuity, has already made significant strides in these areas, including advances in 3D printing and additive manufacturing to build components that can endure the stresses of hypersonic flight. However, even with these breakthroughs, achieving operational readiness by 2030 remains a daunting task. The SR-72 represents more than just the successor to the legendary Blackbird. It's a bold leap into the future of hypersonic technology and unmanned aviation. Will it live up to its promise of being faster, stealthier, and deadlier than its predecessor? Only time will tell. What do you think? Will we see the SR-72 emerge as the pinnacle of hypersonic technology by the 2030s, or is it still a distant dream? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. And if you enjoyed this deep dive into aviation history and innovation, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you in the next one. Imagine a plane so advanced it can vanish into thin air, outrun any fighter jet, and strike with pinpoint accuracy. Welcome to the world of the X-44 Manta, the Pentagon's once top secret $300 million marvel. For years, whispers about the X-44 Manta have circulated, an aircraft so cutting edge it seemed like something out of science fiction. But now, with newly declassified information, we're pulling back the curtain on this revolutionary stealth fighter. Why was this invisible airplane created? What makes it so powerful? And is there any way to stop it? Today we dive into the secrets of the X-44 Manta, a game-changing aircraft that could redefine the future of warfare. The X-44 Manta, developed by Lockheed Martin in the 1990s, was envisioned as a tailless, state-of-the-art stealth platform. Its unique design drastically reduced radar visibility, while its innovative aerodynamics enhanced maneuverability. But what truly set it apart was its ability to reach supersonic speeds 1,740 miles per hour and climb to altitudes of 68,900 feet, making it perfect for reconnaissance and combat missions. This aircraft's capabilities didn't end with speed. Equipped with parallax, a groundbreaking coating, the MANA could render itself invisible, not just to radar, but to the naked eye. This technology worked by transmitting images of the aircraft's surroundings across its surface, creating an illusion of complete disappearance. An aircraft that could vanish while striking with hypersonic missiles traveling at 2,850 miles per hour? It's no wonder the project was classified and shrouded in mystery for years. Rumors swirled that the Manta was too powerful to reveal to the world. Its arsenal included precision-guided bombs and cutting-edge weapon systems with whispers of an electromagnetic gun that could obliterate targets from vast distances. Even without engaging in combat, the Manta's stealth and speed made it a formidable presence. But here's the twist. After years of silence, recent Pentagon leaks confirm that not only does the X-44 Manta exist, but it has been continuously refined to perform some of the most complex and dangerous missions imaginable. This revelation has sent shockwaves through military and defense circles worldwide, opening the floodgates to intense debates about the implications of such a revolutionary aircraft and how to counter an unprecedented threat of this magnitude. The confirmation of the X-44 Manta's existence shatters years of speculation and mystery surrounding the program. For decades, rumors swirled about an advanced U.S. stealth aircraft capable of feats that seemed impossible even by cutting-edge aviation standards. Some dismissed the Manta as a pipe dream or disinformation tactic, while others insisted it was a black-budget project hidden in the Pentagon's shadowy world of classified defense programs. Now, with official leaks shedding light on its existence, the mystery has only deepened. How advanced is this aircraft? And more importantly, what missions has it been silently executing under the radar all these years? The continuous refinement of the X-44 Manta suggests that the U.S. military has been leveraging cutting-edge technologies to keep it ahead of global competition. Its tailless design Hypersonic capabilities and revolutionary parallax cloaking technology aren't just feats of engineering. They represent a paradigm shift in how stealth aircraft operate. By eliminating the tail, a feature that typically increases radar cross-sections, the Manta achieves near-total invisibility to enemy detection systems. Couple this with its ability to reach supersonic speeds in seconds, and you have an aircraft that is not only undetectable, 
but also capable of delivering devastating strikes before an adversary even knows it's there. This revelation has sparked global unease. In military and defense circles, it raises urgent questions about how to counter an aircraft that appears nearly invulnerable. Traditional air defense systems designed to detect and target conventional aircraft are rendered almost useless against the Manta's stealth and speed. Even advanced radar systems would struggle to pick it up, while its hypersonic weaponry outpaces most missile defense technologies. The combination of these factors has left military strategists scrambling to develop countermeasures. But the reality is that existing defense systems may be woefully inadequate. The implications of the Manta's capabilities go beyond defense concerns. They challenge the very balance of power on the global stage. If one nation possesses a weapon system so advanced that it can neutralize threats without retaliation, it creates an enormous strategic advantage. This imbalance forces other nations to invest heavily in their own stealth and hypersonic programs, accelerating an arms race that was already moving at breakneck speed. Countries like Russia and China, which have been making strides in stealth aircraft and hypersonic technology, now face the daunting prospect of catching up to an American program that has been secretly refined for decades. Furthermore, the Pentagon's decision to declassify information about the Manta at this specific moment raises questions. Is this revelation a strategic move to deter potential adversaries? By showcasing the Manta's capabilities, the U.S. may be signaling that any hostile action would be met with overwhelming and technologically superior force. Alternatively, it could be a warning shot meant to instigate further investment in military technology by allies and adversaries alike, thus fueling the ongoing technological arms race. On the other hand, this revelation also prompts concerns about accountability and oversight. Black budget projects like the X-44 Manta often operate in near total secrecy, shielded from public scrutiny and even from most government officials. The confirmation of the Manta's existence raises important ethical questions. Who decides how such technologies are developed and deployed? What safeguards are in place to prevent misuse? And what happens if these advancements fall into the wrong hands? The global response to the X-44 Manta will likely shape the future of military strategy and defense policy for years to come. As nations grapple with the reality of an aircraft that can seemingly rewrite the rules of modern warfare, one thing is certain. The era of traditional military tactics is over. In its place is a new age defined by stealth, speed, and technological supremacy, and the X-44 Manta stands at its forefront. The X-44 Manta isn't just an airplane, it's a symbol of the future, a future where the boundaries of stealth and speed are pushed to unimaginable limits. Its declassification forces us to rethink military strategies and raises profound questions about defense, offense, and the balance of power in the modern world. As other nations race to catch up, the X-44 Manta reminds us that the technologies of tomorrow are already here. But are we ready to face them? Stay tuned as we continue to explore the innovations reshaping our world. And remember, what's classified today could be tomorrow's biggest revelation. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and join us next time for more groundbreaking discoveries.